Is chest overrated? What's going on, everybody? This is Temperature Check. I am your host, as always, man. Mr. Check the Temperature, how y'all doing? Before we get started with today's content, I must do what I always do anytime you see me on your screen. And that's thank you guys for the likes, comments, shares, most importantly, those subscriptions. So whether you be a day one fan or somebody who just started rocking with the channel today, man, I greatly appreciate it. And if you're loving what I got going on my YouTube and you want to see more of me, easy money, man. You follow me, I'll follow you right back. We'll build this thing together. So check me out on Twitter, Mr. Temp Check. Hit me up on Instagram, Mr. Check the Temperature. I'm even on Clubhouse, Mr. Dot Temp Check. But before we get started with today's content, Content. I gotta remind y'all, I'm still slinging this temperature check of Pearl, man. Still selling hoodies, still selling hats, and I even got a couple white t shirts. So if you're interested in that apparel, man, hit me up in the comment section, hit me up in my social medias. I got y'all. Been shipping out, did my first international order, so things is going good. But I wanna make sure you got an opportunity to buy from me as well, man. Support black business, support small business. But let's get right off into it, man. So is chest overrated? My rebuttal to that is, where do you have him ranked? In order to find that out, I got to know where you have him ranked. Um, and this is really uh, a continuation of a conversation that Vitafly started on his Twitter, where he asked the same question, is chest overrated? But I was about to answer that, but then I got some, I got a notification today. Chess came out with a diss record. So we're going to listen to that, man. We're going to hear this top tier uh, response, and then we're going to talk about it. Is Chess overrated or not? Let's listen to what he got to say. Okay. I like the beat. This is a real gritty feel. You got that gritty feel. He couldn't have been on that top tier track, man. I like this gritty feel. He from Cortland Ave, man. Easy. Shout out to Hurricane. Okay. He going crazy on easy. Sending threats. Your Honor. Holmesy. Lou Castro. Oh my goodness, walking over the body like Teron Lou. Calico. Clips, Conceded and Loso. Summer Madness coming. Easy, I know you not ducking. Well, clearly he just went at the entire URL roster. I think it was a very, very good diss record, personally. Hold on, we don't need no, re we don't need no remix. Um, so when I think about Chess... Chest is one of the most talented MCs in battle rap. You got to understand, 
he's only 21 now. Think how many people he's battled. Think how many years he's been doing this. From the BET, UFF, all the way to URL. Yeah, I mean, he had some growing pains when he was younger. But again, he's only 21 now. He's rapping with grown men. But I already know what you're saying. Y'all don't care how old he is when he is battling on the URL. Okay, I get that. But with age, should come wisdom. You 16 and 17 trying to talk to 25, 30, 35 plus year old men about life. It's hard for me to believe that. You know what I'm saying? What, like, what, what struggles are you talking about? But he had his struggles. He had to make a bowl out of a soda can. Like, come on, man. Like, we remember this. Chess is one of the most talented battle rappers. And let's not forget the run that he was on, man. I think a lot of y'all forgot about the run that he was on. Think about this. He came back. He had Geechee. He had a great battle with Twerk. But then he got Geechee, Bad News, Old Red, Danny Myers. He did the two-on-two -two with Loaded Hollows with only two weeks prep. Remember that they only had two weeks prep. Remember how his his attitude going into the battle. Fearless, completely fearless. Body Tory though, Jerry West. But like again, like I said, he's young. He's had his falls. He's had his pitfalls. So you think about the John John the Dine. Got him up out of there. K Shine got him up out of there. B Magic he got himself out of there. When it comes to chess, my my belief is that he is a top tier. If he is top tier, no, scratch that. If twerk is top tier, chess is top tier. What is the difference? I'm what is the difference? They both got star power, both got bars, both got performance, both got believability, wordplay. They have the same intangibles. So don't tell me that chess is not top tier if you put in twerk in this conversation with top tier. What is the difference? Please tell me. I'm interested to know. I want to know what is the difference. I believe that chess and easy to block captain, that is the battle that we want to see. Why do we want to see it? One, because easy called chess out. He said that's who he wanted in 2021. He told chess to come outside. Chess is outside. He's letting you know he's back. He's grown now. It's about to be different. If he gets that preparation down, the same, the same problem that Twerk has, preparation, 12 Ps. And I'm not talking about the Ps that... Um, Shout out to Jay Black. I'm not talking about his, the P cinnamon that he has. I'm talking about 12 Ps. Piss poor preparation promotes piss poor performance. Piss poor performance promotes pain. And that's what it's like when you see Chess up there stumbling and bumbling and choking. It's painful to watch knowing the potential and the star power that he has. If he wanted to be a top five battle rapper in the URL, he very well could do that. He stood in front of Ars. Remind you, he stood in front of Ars. He stood in front of Loaded Lux. He stood in front of Hollow to Don. He's done that. He stood in front of Rock. He stood in front of Av. He's only 21. Best case scenario, Summer Madness. I need to see Easy to Block Captain versus Chess. It's different. Y'all know that. It's different. But if you don't want to give me that, put them in an Ultimate Madness 3. And I know what you're thinking. Prep time, prep time. I get that. But if everyone's on the same type of time he's on, and he's taking a layoff, which was very good for him. Because, again, like I said, he bodied by uh, John John the Don, had the app battle with B-Magic, clearly lost that, no prep, stated that he... It's hard for him to get motivated for people he's not motivated to battle. So then they gave him K-Shine. They gave him his personal end game. And he came up short. But again, he's only 21, man. What were you doing at 21? How was your preparation at 21? Better yet, how was your preparation at 16, 17 years old? Y'all remember cramming all night uh, doing homework, studying for tests, right? Okay, then. 
translate that into battle rap. But the star power is there. So where do I have chess rank? I have chess rank. He is very much a top tier. If you're going to put Twerk there. Now, if you're not going to put Twerk there, then I'm going to make the case that he is a high volume mid tier. Only reason I wouldn't put him as a top tier outright is because of the lack of preparation. And we need to see the consistency. Again, he had a run. He had a run. He was up for champion of the year. He he could have had that type of he had that type of year. He could have had that type of argument until he met John John the Don. But y'all let me know what y'all think. What do y'all think about the disc record towards Easy to Block and the rest of the URL? What do you think about Chess and where I have him rated? Again, if you're not putting Twerk in the, in the top tier, I'm cool with that. But don't tell me you're putting Twerk up there and you're not putting Chess up there. Because I see no difference. This is Temperature Check. I am your host as always, man. Mr. Check the Temperature. Like, comment, subscribe to the channel. And you know the deal. Like always, we're just getting started.